the nucleus of the pycnospore migrates into the receptive hypha and subsequently inside strands of mycelium deep into the mesophyll of the meadow rue's leaf. Here the nucleus reproduces itself many times over. Two nuclei of each mating type pair up. These cells, which are now dicaryotic, become parent cells for the esiospores of leaf rust. The esiospores develop in the form of chains. They are produced within an open cup-like organ, the esium. After being released, the esiospores are carried by the wind back to the other host, the cereal. This is where the dicaryotic esiospore germinates. The infection leads to the development of dicaryotic mycelium, from which in turn dicaryotic uridiniospores and later on in the year teliospores originate. The dicaryotic phase ends with the basidiospores, which are once again haploid. So the complete life cycle of leaf rust includes five spore stages. Puccinia recondita is macrocyclic. <laughs>